happy Wednesday. If you're having a great day, whatever day it actually is. I have had a busy morning, but I'm home now and I'm gonna paint. That's exciting. I'm thrilled. And then I'm gonna shoot some craft videos. Yay! So, paint and craft day over here in Alabama. I have bought these today. Um, these are for the folks that donated to the GoFundMe. I'm gonna get your paintings done hopefully this week and shipped to you. Sorry I'm a little behind. Please forgive me. And then I'm also just gonna play with those two. My mom wants a cow painting and so I'll probably end up painting her a bigger one than this but I've never painted a cow so I just want a practice canvas. I'm also going to prime all of the canvases with gesso. I, I have a little bit of experience with gesso but I didn't know that you can prime your canvases with it and it actually helps coverage a lot. So I'm excited because with those, um, they didn't really cover very well in the beginning when I was painting the background. And I was like, what is up with this? And apparently it's, it has something to do with where they're from. But we won't talk about that. So anyway, and I meant which country they're made in. I'm gonna prime these guys with gesso. And also you can use gesso for like a, te a texture on your canvas if you wanted to go that route. Hi. Hey, how's it going guys? How's it going with you? Good, I'm gonna run to the bank. Oh, well, that's exciting. Okay, cool. Good to see you. I'm glad we were able to cross paths today. Anyway, all right, I'm gonna get busy. I'll talk to you guys later. All right, I've got my painting drab on. So I guess I'm ready to do this. I shouldn't get the gesso all over me. <laughs> but with me, you never know. You're not messy when you're painting. You're not doing it right. I don't actually know. I, if you're not a messy painter, then that has nothing to do with your skills level. I'm sorry. I don't know what I'm talking about. Ru and Roland have a body. <laughs> hey, kitty. Hey, kitty. Oh, you're a friendly kitty. Roland doesn't like you. <laughs> Sorry. Maybe you can stop by another day. Hey. He's so cute. Come back. Come back. <laughs> you just scared him. <laughs> oh. He's so sweet. He's very sweet. You're sweet too. How's it going? Good, that's pretty smooth, sir. Eh, not really. <laughs> <laughs> you still like me? <laughs> He's not sure. sure. You know what's hilarious? I just love that door open. They could just run out. Yeah, they're, they're not concerned with... They really don't have that door figured out yet. Okay. Going back to my cutting and my Disney music. <laughs> Sugar. Makes that medicine go down, yo. So they say that something is an obsession to a healthy level when it affects your everyday life. I would say rearranging all your furniture just so you could shoot a YouTube video with somewhat like three-point lighting, uh, an obsession, wouldn't you? I would agree with that. But it looks like you're doing a great job. Oh, thanks. If you'll notice above her, the cool camera that is attached to the lighting getting the overhead shot. That's pretty cool, right guys? Yeah, I thought so too. There's only one issue with it though. Like every time I go to hit record or pause or something, it, you know, of course swings. So then I have to kind of stop it. And then like, maybe I didn't put it on the right angle. So I have to readjust it. Ah, but it's all good. I think it's pretty cool. I just had a thought. Look at this Joker hanging on the wall. What if we, yeah, maybe for another video we'll do that. Interesting thoughts though. I like it. Hannah's shooting a craft video. This is the second craft video we've shot. We're gonna do hopefully one more after this. Yeah, one more today after this and then maybe even a few more before her channel actually launches. It's exciting. <gasps> yeah. Very exciting. Overexposed. Hopefully there we go. you guys will like it. I hope you like it. Yeah. Hope you like it. Battery dying. Seriously? Hot dogs for dinner. Hot dogs for dinner. Yes. The cool thing about this is we get to eat these kettle 
brand crinkle cut potato chips that I love. Salt and fresh ground pepper, great taste naturally. I love these things, guys. They are like, oh, I ain't good to eat these. She likes those, but girl, mm -hmm. I like those. No, they do a bomb. Whatever, girl. Anna has finished her first video. Oh, well, technically it's her second, but first of the day. That's exciting. We're gonna shoot one more later today though. I think we're gonna wait till we get home though from like, oh, can you see me through the umbrella? Probably can't. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna shoot another one later today after we do some errands and after dinner. So, dinner first. Ooh, kettle chips, kettle chip, go, 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 kettle chip. <laughs> I feel like a four year old when I get excited hey, about, I when I get excited about food, I feel like a four year old, but you know what? Whatever, I don't care. In the car again. I can't believe I'm in the car again. Yes, I was singing. Sorry. There was a phone on someone's car and Randy was going to this apartment to see if it was his. All right, he's back, look. Hey, it's me. Yeah, like as I was saying, we saw a phone laying on a car and Randy went to just some random apartment. Like that was interesting, you just, picked one and it was the right one he's like hey is this your phone he's like yeah so there you go anyway we are heading out to do a little french or something maybe mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. maybe maybe more like french it'll look yeah yeah i'm just saying we need a bed and some bookcases but we're so we're just trying to get a fill from where oh bump gosh where a good place to buy those things for me. Our first stop on the furniture window shop night. <laughs> what are you calling this? Is Big Lots actually. You never know what you can find at Big Lots. And I have several friends who have bought several pieces from Big Lots. And they're fine. So here we go, Big Lots. And it's right next to my favorite store ever. Yeah. I'm gonna write songs for a living. Is that okay with you? No. <laughs> Anyway, Hobby Lobby is my favorite store ever, If in case you didn't know that, that just... Yeah, so we left Big Lots, and uh, there was a lot there, but we just didn't really like any of the bed stuff. Now we're at Ashley Furniture. Yeah, and all the prices are like slash in half, and they're not what they're listed as. Like so this, it's a little confusing. This is $5.71, but it's actually two ninety nine. dollars <laughs> So... Of course, that is probably just part of the sales gimmick. Yes, but I am scared of that. <gasps> I want the tall woman right here. <laughs> That's what I want. Please, I'll paint that for you, fool. <laughs> Forget a bed, we need this. It wouldn't even fit in our apartment. No. Like we couldn't even get that in our apartment. Hi there, let's buy some furniture. Rooms to go. Bum, 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 bum. So we're gonna check out Rooms to Go, see what they have. I've had some people say that Rooms to Go is actually cheap and like cheaply made furniture, I've heard that. However, I'm okay with getting something a little cheaply made right now, and then we can make it into a guest bedroom later. So we're gonna go check it out and just see what it looks like. We are in rooms to go, and they told us that they don't actually have any fools for adults. They're all for kids. So we're in the adult, uh, the kids section. And, and we're, we're gonna get beds. a bunk bed. Yeah, we're actually gonna get this one. <laughs> you guys think it's cool? You can even pull it out for sleepovers. I'm going to sleep on the top and Ryan's going to have the bottom. Yeah. It'll be fine. Austin, you come over, you can sleep right there. <laughs> or any of you guys, if you come over. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. Let's talk about that. Look at that. Yeah, it is. You have your office. I think that is so cool. I would have loved this as a kid. So yeah, we're going somewhere else. Now we're going to get our furniture from TJ Maxx. They do have some furniture. Yeah, they do. But not the kind we're interested in right now. Right now. Yeah, Rooms to Go was a total wash. I don't think awful. I'm ever going to look there again for anything. No. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Was. And the lady, as we were uh, asking her where the full beds were, and Anna was like, oh, these are for us. And no, she asked if, who, she was like, now, you know, who are you shopping for? And I was like, it's, it's for us, it's our bed. I said, yep, we're shopping for our bed in the kids section. Just kind of joking. She goes, well, if you buy a full bed, you're going to look in the kids section. Oh. <laughs> My I goodness. It. I'm leaving TJ Maxx and there's an interesting woman trying to put six puppies in one buggy. And you have to see. What? Come on. I don't think we got a good shot of it, but it's okay. There's like these six or seven puppies all in this back seat of this SUV. And this older woman is trying to put them all six into a buggy. 
or get them out of the buggy. I'm not sure, but it is quite frankly the strangest thing I've seen today. Well, hello there. I just wanted to come spend with you guys for a minute. Randy got us caught up with the vlogs tonight, thankfully, so he edited two. And now I think we're back on track, and that's great. So tomorrow, you will be seeing yesterday's, which is perfect. Anyway, I think I'm about to go to bed, have a work in the morning, my little munchkin's feeling better, thankfully. And tomorrow night is the kickoff for the women's retreat at my church. And I'm going with my mom and Liz, and I'm actually really excited about it. Last year was my first time to go, and so um, I was nervous up until the conference started, just because I didn't know what to expect. Like this year, I'm so ready for it. Like I cannot wait until tomorrow night. <laughs> it's tomorrow night from like seven to nine, and then there's like events you can do after the conference ends. And then it's from Friday from like 8.30 to four. So I'm really, I'm looking forward to the speakers that are gonna be there and the worship and just getting, and being able to spend time with Liz and my mom. It'll be delightful. Like I said, I'm really just looking forward to it. I'm not sure what Randy will be up to while I'm away. He said something about watching a documentary alone because he doesn't ever get to watch documentaries because they're not my favorite. I do like some, but as a whole, I don't just run to a documentary, you know, when I have my, when I have free time. I would rather do something else. But he loves them, and that is A-OK. -okay. And I love that he loves them. <laughs> so I think he's gonna be watching documentaries all night on Thursday. More power to him. I'll try to buy him some like man foods or something. Maybe he can, he'll go get something, I don't know. <laughs> anyway. Hello, everybody sit down for class. Let's talk for a minute, okay? First of all, Roland, where's your homework? <laughs> you failed the class. Oh no. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I don't give a care. You should care. No more scratches. What about your future? For you. Hmm? You must do your homework. What about your future? Kids, this is what happens when you don't do your homework. You become an angry kitty. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, I'm out of man. Ooh. Secondly, it feels amazing outside. Oh, it's so cold out there. I love it. Would you like to feel? The door is right there. Go feel. It's okay. You don't have to, but it feels amazing. I'm really excited. Tomorrow is my first small group with the production people from Highlands. What I mean by that is like there's a video small group. You know, I talked about that briefly and it's tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. at the main campus. I'm gonna go and have fun. So by the time you see this, it's already be passed, but hopefully it was amazing and they will give me tips on how to make better videos for you guys. Yay! Yay! We only shot one craft video tonight. Yeah. We were gonna shoot two, but because of time, we weren't able to. By the way, we are going to get that bed, I believe, at Ashley Furniture. Okay. We just uh, need a way to transport it. That's one thing to mark off our list, and $100 less than what we were expecting to pay. Yahoo, that's the best part. Under budget. Woo! I think that's all we got. All right, that does it for us guys. We're gonna wrap up the vlog tonight. I do wanna give a very special happy birthday shout out to Elizabeth Butler. Today is your birthday. Hope that you've enjoyed your birthday and that it's been great and that God blesses you. If you guys like this video, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment down below about anything you saw in today's video and we will talk to you guys soon. We love you guys, God bless. Come here, give me a hug. God bless you.